and it's about the value proposition okay now if sales is the number one skill that you've got to learn and master in order to survive as an entrepreneur right which I don't think that's up for debate anymore if sales is the most important skill the number one for you to master to survive as an entrepreneur then the most important what are you doing with your life? Why have you got passions and gifts and talents, do you think? You've been given them to exploit them in the service of others. And I'm giving you an invitation now to turn them into money, to get other people to pay you to do what you love doing. You love it so much, you do it all day long for free. But this is a commercial world. So I'm gonna show you how to turn it into money and create a small business out of it so that you can get paid your worth and do what you wanna do with your life rather than working for somebody else's goals. Now, if you've connected with this, I'm gonna show you how to do it. I'm here to solve a problem. And I'm here to solve a problem for entrepreneurs, small business owners who hate selling. Now, that's not your problem, you, that's the root of it. Your problem is that you're running out of cash, okay? You thought that passion alone and hard work, which are admirable traits, admirable characteristics, you thought that that, en that would be enough to accelerate your business more than sustain it and take you to, to consistently high earnings. And you're finding that that's not the case. You're finding that your inability to get over objections like, I want to think about it, I'll get back to you, you know, give us a few days, we're really good, but we, we, you know, we need to consider it. Things like that, they don't come back, that's what you're discovering. Um, you're discovering that clients don't always tell you the truth, you know, there's, they'll go away and, uh, and the, to your face they'll tell you they've got every intention of making you their choice and only in a couple of days, and then you find out, days, weeks later, that's not the case. So you're, you're not onboarding enough clients, you're not securing enough clients, you're running out of cash. It's keeping you awake at night. You're, you're the, you hate selling because it, it kind of, where it sits with you mentally, ethically, yeah, it, based on integrity, you've got a, a belief, a firm belief, it feels so true to you, it feels so real to you, that selling is, is you know, it's, it's, it's a bit unnecessary, it's kind of like a, a, um, a, a sleazy subject, a, a practice that's fraught with, you know, um, deception, manipulation. And because of that, you've chosen to avoid it. And it's not part of your identity. You wouldn't like to, your friends, your family, or people you know, to, to used to be saying, I've closed the deal. Th those things don't go hand in hand. I have always been fascinated by the subject of potential and unlocked potential. Ever since I was a kid, and you know, an encourager. I was always an encourager, a born encourager of others. I love to see other people go to, past their potential, you know, to, to, to go past what was previously thought possible. You know, surge past it, break records. I, I've always loved that. It's, it's always lit me up inside. So that's by why I became a coach. You know, first in my, in my employed career, I was a trainer, salesman trainer, um, leader. And why the last five years I've dedicated my my life to being a coach, a sales coach, marketing coach, business coach. But I just love, absolutely love, seeing other people break through, break through the mental barriers first and then break through the real world barriers and crushing it and, and going way beyond the potential. And also to know that I've played a part in that. That's really what lights me up as well, to know that I've played a small part in helping somebody else smash it and get through their potential. And, and it's life-changing stuff. You know, that it really is. You know, if it's just a bit of coaching in the right way, at the right time, with the right bedside manner, you know, appropriately done with the right skills, can just unleash somebody's potential and change their life. I will create the words for you. That's my area of expertise. I've been in sales since I was seven years old. I'm 47 now. I sold 57 pounds worth of, 57 million pounds worth of personal sales in my career. Led others to over a billion pounds worth of sales. Okay, faced every single sales situation that any of you will ever face. Okay, and it's experiential. I've been there, I've done it, and I'm still selling now. I'm learning how to sell in the new ways now, on the online ways, and I'm applying all the same methodologies and attitudes, passion, persistence, and, and applying to it the science of personality profiling and neuroscience, okay? What we need to do to speak to the limbic system, the emotional brain of our perfect clients who inspire them.